Oaxaca is a lovely city in Mexico that tells a lot about its history. From a waterfall that is one of the most photographed places in the world to fun festivals, there's always something to do. Here are nine things to do in Oaxaca. Be sure to stay until the end because we'll reveal an incredible natural attraction. Number nine, visit the Mercado Benito Juarez Market. Known as the Oaxaca City Market, this is one of the best local markets to visit if you want to get a true taste of what Mexico is all about, especially like you've seen in movies. As soon as you step into the market, the first thing you'll notice is how everywhere is bursting with colors. Every part of the market is filled with food stalls of all kinds with a long line of vendors, making the market as big as a full four streets block. You can also pick up different kinds of trinkets here as souvenirs. The aisles in the Mercado Benito Juarez market are a pleasant combination of food stands, festivities decorations, and handmade crafts. So if you want to indulge in some meal making, this is the best place to find local ingredients. Be sure to check out the Tejate drink and take your taste buds on an unforgettable journey of delight while here. Number 8. Visit the Santo Domingo Temple Of course, you deserve to learn about the rich history of Oaxaca and have a first-hand experience of some secrets of the local culture. And one of the best places to experience this is at the Santo Domingo Temple. This temple is so easy to explore that you could take a quick trip here and you will have experienced a huge part of Mexico within two days. The temple is a major part of Mexican history, starting from the La Reforma times to its journey back to the church. Moreover, there will be a local guide available at the temple to tell you all about its magnificent architecture, vault, and breathtaking history. So be sure to ask as many questions as possible. Rest assured, it's going to be an intriguing experience. Number 7. Explore the Museo de las Culturas Known as the Museum of Cultures, it would most likely take you all day to explore all 14 rooms within the walls of this hotbed of history. It contains everything you need to know about Oaxaca, including how it started and all the events that have taken place ever since. So if you're big on learning history, you don't want to miss out on a chance to explore the Museo de las Culturas. While here, you can learn about the different cultures, agricultural revolution, archaeology, and so much more, ranging from the pre-Hispanic times to the modern era. However, it may seem a bit discouraging to see a huge part of the museum's infographics designed in Spanish. Still, this doesn't have to put a damper on your experience. You can simply hire a local guide who will take you through everything you need to know. Number 6. Stroll through the Oaxaca City Botanical Garden Just as there's something for history buffs, there's also room for nature lovers to experience something truly magical. And we're talking about the Oaxaca City Botanical Garden, which has never failed to wow visitors. As part of efforts to preserve as much of this habitat as possible, you can only stroll to the botanical garden using a guided tour. However, you can choose between English and Spanish tours. Meanwhile, Oaxaca is the best city to visit if you want to explore a unique diversity of plants. Indeed, the Oaxaca City Botanical Garden is 2.5 acres of pure bliss, where you'll come in direct contact with hundreds of local plants, including incredibly rare ones. Number 5. Eat Ice Cream at Plaza de la Danza A beautiful basilica to check out here is La Señora de la Soledad, which is the cathedral representing the patron saint of Oaxaca. Of course, this is a very sacred spot and many locals hold important ceremonies within its walls, including weddings, quinceañeras, and baptismal events. After a quick stop here to get a glimpse at one of the most beautiful representations of the Oaxacan culture, you can then head over to the open area just outside the Basilica. This place is known as the Plaza de la Danza, and it's famous for its ice cream. The huge space is filled with several local ice cream stalls where you can explore as many flavors as you want. So don't hold back as you check out as many unique and creative ice cream flavors as possible, including mezcal and chapulín. By the way, if you want to learn how to save money on airfares, then click the link in the description below. This guide will teach you how to always get the cheapest flights. Number 4. Join the Night of the Radishes 
What's a visit to Mexico without participating in at least one local festival? If you're not sure which one to attend and you're in Oaxaca in December, then you should join the Night of the Radishes, which usually takes place on the evening of December 23rd. This is a traditional Oaxacan festival that started as far back as 1897 and features flower growers and market gardeners displaying their unique artistic talents. It includes an exhibition of their specially handmade designs using a corn shell plant known as Totomostle radish and a type of flower called Flor Immortal. The event attracts a huge number of locals to the main square, and you can spend a few hours admiring the creativity of the participants too. Number 3. Visit the Ancient Ruins of Mitla one of the most famous ancient ruins in Mexico is Mitla, and this is especially important for the Zapotec culture. According to legends, Mitla means underworld, and this spot represents a place for the dead. Therefore, this pre-Columbian archaeological site was built as a gateway between the world of the living and dead, and had its roots in the Mesoamerican belief of death being an essential part of life after birth. Surely, you'll learn more about this from a guide who will tell you all about this breathtaking structure. Meanwhile, there's a strong belief by historians that this ancient ruin still looks intact because the Spanish were mesmerized by its beauty and changed their minds about destroying the ancient site. Of course, this is a great spot in Oaxaca that represents the collision of two different cultures. You'll definitely want to learn a lot when you visit. Number 2. Visit El Tule if you're going to Mitla on a sightseeing journey, it's a great idea to visit El Tule as well. And this is because they are on the same path. El Tule is the shortened version of Santa Maria del Tule, which is the name of a small town with one of the most amazing attractions in the city. This town hosts a natural wonder which involves an ancient Awawete tree that's more than a thousand years old and so wide that it would take about 30 children to form a human ring around it. This tree is known locally as El Arbol de Tule, and it has several formations on its trunk. Luckily, the local guides will show you a few of these formations, including ones with shapes of animals like lions and crocodiles. Number 1. Take a picture at Yerve Lagua. Another amazing natural wonder in Mexico is the Yerve Lagua, which is almost two hours away from the city center of Oaxaca. The name means boiling water, which is quite strange because this waterfall is not actually about water. Instead, they are cliff faces covered in calcified mineral deposits that take the shape of falling water. Surely, you can spend a lovely day hiking to the top of this waterfall, where you can also eat a tlayuda and enjoy some fruit juice. If you're up for it, you can also take a dip in the swimming pool here. No doubt, Yerve Lagua is an amazing place to connect with nature while being surrounded by breathtaking views. Click here for more things to do in Mexico.